There we go. Hey guys, what's going on? TWTT time. TWTTTT. The triple T. TWTT time will be TW triple T. TTT. I don't know. <laughs> it's too early for me to come up with something smart, I guess. Anyway, it's been two two weeks since our last show. This uh, episode has been weeks in the planning because it is the Doctor Who Series 8 wrap-up and our official double-digit celebration because now we have Stan back. Yay! Stan uh, is prepping, so he may not be too responsive. I figure I start the pre-show, do a little banter. More with the crowds, do some greetings, some handshaking, kissing some babies, and all that good stuff. Today is Saturday, November 15th. And, uh, ah, gosh, it's already midway through the month. Literally. Where does time go? Anyway, uh, let's see. A lot of stuff to catch up on. I don't even, I don't even know where to begin. It's going to be a slightly different format tonight. Because uh, we have three episodes of Doctor Who to catch up on. Um, so that's episodes 10, 11, and 12 from Series 8. And then Doctor Who's going to go on a little little break until the Christmas episode comes out, which I'm actually excited for. Because I don't think, I, one thing I have to say, I, I don't think they've had a ter ever had a, a bad Christmas, Christmas episode. And uh, they always give some kind of... Uh, backstory or add some extra value I think so something to look forward to regardless of how you felt about series 8 <laughs> I know Stan is fighting himself not to say anything not to be salty about it it's been an interesting uh, season alright we're also joined by Blue Who's equally as quiet because she's just passed out on my desk in front of my monitors. So, she's pooped. She had a, quite an eventful night. <laughs> Playing with our other cat. She has a friend now. The kids, uh, they like bringing in strays. I'm like, well, you know, kind of run that by me because I'm the one that ultimately pays all the bills and pets are expensive. But, you know, I'm a softie, and I can't say no to a stray, because I feel bad for them. But now Blue has a buddy to play with. So that's cool. Personal life stuff. This is behind-the-scenes stuff. I think Stan muted himself so he could concentrate on stuff, yeah. So I don't hear any typing or anything. Stan, at least say hello for the pre-show. Can you hear me? There you hello. go. Yeah, and I muted you because I hadn't uh, plugged in my uh, headphones. Good man, good man. Look at that. We're already back in our flow. Uh -huh. Anticipating the need. So this is episode 11 of Time Wimey Tea Time. Like I said, it is November 15th. 7-14. A fine Saturday. It's actually pretty uh, chilly down south. How about uh, up in D.C., bro? Yeah, it is. At yeah. night, man, it was freezing. Oh, yeah. I mean, literally, it went below freezing. Just a degree or two. Yeah, no, it's, it's gotta got to be dead bitter plants for you. on the balcony, man. <laughs> Dude, it's got to be bitter for you because over here, we, we're already getting a little bit of frost. And the, the morning dew, when you touch the blades of grass, it's like ice. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's always fun. Uh, it's always interesting walking out in the yard. Seeing that morning dew and it's all cold, a whole different effect. Sometimes when you have that little warm front come in early in the morning, or mm -hmm. well, early-ish, you get that weird fog effect and it's like, whoa, horror movie. I'm kind of in a creepy area. We're like in a kind of backwoods. We have a, a prison slash detention center not too far away. Like the makings of a horror. Dude, movie. that's scary. Yeah, man. How like, far? Uh, About uh, five, ten minutes up the road. <laughs> It'd be a brisk walk for, for someone that escapes. And I, I gave my uh, a better half 
uh, all the trust and the initiative and finding us a nice place. And I trusted her in, every, in all the arrangements. And I don't think she thought it through too well because when the wind comes in, the wind comes in so strong since we're close to water that sometimes the house shakes. I'm like, that's not cool. <laughs> uh-huh. Fortunately, I don't think we're in tornado in a tornado area. But I definitely foresee some monsoon, hurricane-type weather. Those winds coming hard, they slap you up. Yeah. The good, the good part about that is uh, it might curb the the smoking habit. We're, we're slowly weaning off the smoking because it's not financially viable. <laughs> but that's our therapy. People that, don't, people that don't smoke don't understand that. It's like, that's an expensive habit. You should quit it. It's like, well... Everybody has a habit that's like uh their their evolve for steam, right? Right. You know, the, the, the therapeutic thing. And the creative outlets help with that, but sometimes you just need something that's you need some kind of advice. We just we chose one of the lesser ones, you know, because cow tipping ain't, ain't cool. It's only funny <laughs> ones, then then people get hurt. I don't know why I said cow tipping. It sounded funny in my head. This is why I'm not a night, uh, late night talk show host. I'll monologue and people go, okay. Moving on now. Yeah, you can tell Stan's, uh. I'm typing. Yeah. Your attention is split. I, I suck at multitasking. It's okay. Blue- I like to think that I can multitask, but it's not true. Well, Blue, Blue will fill in the gap. Yeah, she'll fill in the gaps. Meow. <laughs> uh, multitasking ain't easy. And by the way, for those who don't know, Blue is the uh, the mascot for the Geeky Antics Network. Cool little cat. And before you, before you non-cat lovers say anything, she's a cool cat. Trust me. Everybody fall in love with her because she's fluffy and, she, and, and she's sweet. She just has to be in the mood, like like a woman, like any woman in any species. Don't mess with her. Let her do things according to her own rules. You know, don't you know? You leave her alone. She'll come to you, curl up on the, in a ball on your lap if you if that's it, what you're into. Lately, she's been uh, doing the little kneading thing the cats do. I like that. Yeah. That's just, that's one of the things I like that cats do. Yeah, it's cute. The only thing some cats don't know that 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 well, like they don't know any better, so like they take out their claws when they do it, and it's like, mm-hmm. ow. She's good about that. Uh, I know a lot of people don't like cats when they lick you because they feel like sandpaper, but that's actually one of the highest compliments. If they do that, they feel like you're you're one of their kin. She does that. Like, we'll take a nap, and she'll join me. You know, and she'll just uh. Curl up in a ball next to my head and like lick my bald head. It's funny. It's like, thank you. Now I'm definitely clean up there. Might be missing uh some layers of my epidermis, but <laughs> yeah, we'll be getting started here officially in about eight minutes. I drank a lot of coffee this morning, so I might have to take a uh, another bio break. I should probably but cue up some music. There you go. Yeah. Cue up a little some some. Let's find something good. It's not good to podcast on the full bladder. And you, and you young folks out there, wait wait till you get older, you start losing control of bodily functions, which is really bad if you start laughing. Dad had no comments. Like, mm, we'll leave that alone. Right, Stan? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I said yes to, but okay. I That's support you, man. The love. I miss this guy, man. We haven't uh, really had, we've both been really busy and we haven't had a chance to really even talk that much. So. I know, you had your move. Ugh. 
Remind me. I'm trying to put that behind me. But it's me. done, dude. It's done. Yeah. Yeah, but I paid the price, man. Stuff broke as I predicted, and I, the most mo the biggest one in my back. I broke my back. That's hard to fix. Yeah. That Stuff, you know, things, fix. material things. Eh, you can replace those, but. Ugh. You know, those little things add up. It's like our toaster got broken. And I think my computer got damaged a little bit in the process. Just the hard drive, the hard drive had some slight damage, so I had to uh, run a repair on it. And that, now it's working okay. But hard drives are very delicate. Computers are not meant to be moved around a lot. When you move a computer around, after a while, you start losing uh, sectors on your hard drive, and then things start to crash and lock up. It's not cool. But anyway, here's some music. Is this, do I this still, uh, this still sound okay, Dan? You sound good, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I do like the setup, though. I like the way everything is laid out now. It's a lot more comfortable. I have a uh, wiggle room here in the man cave slash studio. I do need to soundproof, though. The acoustics, we have uh, raised roofs in here. So mm -hmm. the, the sound travels even better, which is actually kind of bad for what I'm trying to do. But here we go. Let's see. Well, what's a good song to take a break with? I like this one right here. And of course the dog starts to bark. Everything was chill. Everything was good. Wife and kids went to the grocery store. Cats are sleeping. But the dog barking at God knows what. I think I know what he's barking at. Still hear me okay? You're good. 
How about now? Any change? I don't. Yeah, you and the dog are good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let me let me go handle that real quick. Cause... Is that Layla? No. Uh, no. Lila, had we had to keep Lila. at my daughter's house because. Bring her back, man. I know. I like her so much better. I can't stand this dog. And I love all animals. Don't, don't leave anyone behind, man. Dude, I know she's family. I try to explain that. She's like, but I don't want to. And my wife's like, I don't want to have to hide her. Because, like, cause, you know, people are stupid. They're like, they have the stupid uh, ad aggressive dog, aggressive breed stuff, and the weight regulations. And yeah, I think you can work. You could work around that by getting the dog registered as a assistant dog, you know? Right, right. But it's, it's still stupid because she's like the sweetest dog ever. She's really chill. She's, you know, she doesn't bother anyone. She's good with kids. This dog is just a jerk. Hold on. Let me see what, what's going on. Meanwhile, there's silent stand. We need music. Is anyone on Twitch? I don't know. No one is on Twitch. How about our games? We are not on all games. Awesome. What? 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 I said we are not on all games. What do you mean? They're playing music. Oh no, I'm not streaming on all games. I'm about to stream now. Oh okay, good. Yeah. No, I have to start. <laughs> I have to start on the on the dot. So let me. Get hey BFT, I didn't see you on the users list. How you doing, man? Yeah, the party's about to get started. All right. Let me make sure everything's good to go. We're going to get the all game stream started. All right. Connecting to Shopcast. Oh, that was quick. That was the quickest I ever connected to that. And we should be live. All games, how do you hear us? How we sound? I hear music still. Well, it's a little lag. It's a little slight delay. Right. Da, 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 da. You might have there to reload go. the page. It no, does... don't tell me I have to reload. Yeah. Now playing disc two zero two horizon. Really? There we go. I hear yes. That sound all right? I, I hear a, elect a slight electronic buzz on all games. On all games? Oh. Whoa. You hear it? Um Yeah, I might I think I know what it might be, but eh, they'll have to deal with it. <laughs> 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 Alright, so let's get this bad boy started. So we stay on schedule we need to keep track of the time. So we had about a nineteen minute pre show. It's now 12.03, so we're a little late. Well, not really. We've been out, out the whole time. But anyway, here we go.